Also with Karakorum, I'm going to show you this footboard changeover in the field and give you some tips and tricks on how to deal with snow and ice build up. First thing I'm going to do is take off my bindings. Got them together, clearing the bases of snow. So I'm going to highlight for you the areas to clean off your splitboard interface in sticky snow conditions. So for my changeover from tour to ride, I'm going to take the toe side of my board and nestle that in the snow. Oftentimes you'll have a buildup of snow on the inner seam of the board. And because our board clips and system clamp everything together, you want to get that clean. Then I'll put my binding in the snow upside down. And I can take my high back and use that on the middle seam of the board. In these conditions, I'm not having terrible sticking of the inner seam, but I'll show you that's what you want it to look like. Pretty clean. My toe side. Same thing. Just want to clean off my board. Clean off the board clips if I need to. First thing I'm going to do is engage my board clips. And I have a little cordelette on here to make it easy for me to use my gloves in cold weather. Then I'll put on my tail clip. Move to my front board clip. my front tip clip. Now, as you can see, I have some snow build up on my ride mode attachment. What I'm going to do is take my binding, I can use my high back just to chop it off. And this is pretty, pretty sticky, wet snow. When it gets really cold and things are frozen to the board, you're going to rely on the high back more. What you'll find is that it's a great tool for cleaning this area between your tabs. Same thing, swipe off my toe attachment, just get all general snow clear. Check the bottom of my binding, it's good. Rotate the binding down and settle it into the ride mode, engaging my lever and my lock block. And I change my ride stride from tour mode to ride mode. Change your lever, rotate the binding in, engage the lever. Ride mode, ready to shred. So I'm going to change over from ride mode back to tour mode. First thing I do is disengage my lock block, open my lever, Set my binding in the snow upside down. I'm do a board clip, nose clip. Disengage my back binding. Okay, to do the changeover to tour mode, I'm going to use my tour mode axle. Okay, open my lever. I'm resting the axle into the cradle, making sure it's straight. I rotate the binding down. I'm doing the last Okay, I'm going to show you the step-in feature from ride mode to tour mode. Take my binding off. Take my back binding off. Now that I have my skins on and my poles out, to Set my tour mode axle straight into the cradle. Just take my tour mode axle. Push the cam over. Good to go. To engage my short climbing wire. I'm going to do the head of my ski pole. 
tall wire. Need to make sure that it's in the riser position and not in the heel lockdown position. I get to the 